Tony, uh, good morning everyone, it's Tony, so in anticipation for later on this weekend, the 18th as well as the 19th of October, Blackpink will be releasing their guest appearances of both Running Man as well as Knowing Bros, so very, very excited for them, I wanted to put this out for you guys because we recently got the previews and I just hadn't had the time yet to react to them, so here's going to be the previews for both Knowing Bros as well as Running Man, both very, very fun shows, a lot of comedy, a lot of humor, we get to see the girls kind of like just be themselves, be their crackhead selves, so without further ado, let's get into it. I'm going to start off with Knowing Bros, and then we're going to get, finish off with Running Man. Oh, quick mention. If you haven't checked out already, I will leave linked in the description box the Blackpink playlist, which has our, their prison interview, their album, the album. We listened to that. We also reacted to Lovesick Girls. We reacted to uh, How You Like That, Ice Cream, reacted to Solos for All the Girls. So feel free to check out everything. I really absolutely love these girls. And I guess making me making this video is kind of like just an emphasis on that also. Oh, do I have the subtitles on? Do we got do we got English subtitles? This okay, no we do not. So we're just gonna we're just gonna leave it, we're gonna rewind. Oh, tomorrow. So something today. <laughs> it's like Apple Heart kind of. Jenny's so cute. <laughs> Lisa doing her like charade or something. Wukong, Wukong. Oh wait, I think I think if I'm correct, he's the main fluent uh, English knowing bro, and so he usually in the previous time that he did, he talked to Jenny, kind of like see test her on English, and she kind of like roasted him for it, and now she's kind of like getting back, I think, at Jisoo, who's trying to check check her English. So it's like Jesus like, yeah, my English is pretty good. Okay, but wait, <laughs> a little slow down there, slow down there. <laughs> oh, I love Jesus. Oh, oh, okay, Jenny. Okay, okay. How you like that? Kill this love? Okay. Oh, we get a bit of... So if you guys weren't aware of Knowing Bros, the formats, like, they get a lot of talk and discussion about just how they enjoy, like, certain things, about, like, secrets that they do. It's very much like an interview, but at the same time, they'll play fun games, and at the end, they'll show off, like, their dancing abilities, usually, or somewhere in the middle, they'll show off, like, the dance. So we're gonna get Lovesick Girls, uh, but then they usually have some throwbacks. They might throw in some oldies, so it'll be lots of fun to see the dancing, too. <laughs> Even got Solo, too. They always have these weird dances too. I never know. <laughs> Lisa Spoon. Ooh, Rosie doing uh, Samina Mina by uh, Shakira. Hip. Uh, wait, I don't remember that. Africa, there we go. Some girls. And of course, the song that's topping the Billboard Top 100 charts worldwide right now. Love Sick Girls, along with the album, topping number two, I believe, in the global uh, Billboard charts. Absolutely breaking records, guys. And then this is like a guessing game, like trivia game. Yeah. <laughs> do. Do, 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 do. So yeah, JTBC, this is going to be airing, I believe, the 18th, and then Running One will be the... I, yes, I could be inversing them, but I know that they're one after another. So this was Knowing Bros, very, very excited for it. It's always very funny, very fun times, especially when he chud and uh, this man here in particular, and then one more. And this man in particular, I find them to be the funniest with their comedy. It's going to be lots of fun to see the girls' interaction because this has actually been a long time since they actually were last on like a variety show. So it's going to be lots of fun. And now we're going to be looking at the Running Man one. Ooh, their outfits are really cute. Jenny has like a bit of like a sexy outfit. Rosie has a bit of a more innocent. Lisa too. Jisoo just has her own like innocent vibe, cute, but Je Jenny definitely has that sexy vibe going on. I like Jenny with bangs. The lovesick girls. Why is it like not 1080? It is 1080, it's weird. <laughs> <Do you know? laughs> 
She's joining it. Who's <laughs> the real thing? <laughs> Just <laughs> Black Punk. A lot of so running man definitely a lot more because it's like actually kind of like a race and say you have like a goal at the beginning of the day and you have to like try to beat the other teams and then at the end whoever wins gets like a reward and whoever loses gets like a punishment there's a lot of games it's like quite kind of like physical a lot of running a lot of like uh fun games so it's going to be definitely interesting to see the girls do this <laughs> <laughs> Jisoo has really good like one-liner questions to like stump people up. She was really good at running men the last time they appeared. It was really really funny. So I like how they're doing the cat ears. Yes, Jisoo, you are you are pretty. And Kwang Zhu and Jenny just have this funny interaction because the last two times that she's appeared on Running Man, she's always had like this like fun, like flirtatious, like kind of flirtatious uh, interactions with him. You can definitely check them out online. Just type in Jen Jenny Kwang Zhu or Jenny Running Man and you'll definitely find it up there. And it's really funny. And he now ever since is like just the funny comedian between the Jenny, Jenny and him. Jenny always kills him. Oh yes, we get Jenny. We get them in rabbit costumes. Could be very cute. I'm so excited for the Running Man performance. So guys, this was my quick reaction to obviously Blackpink's upcoming two variety show appearances for both Knowing Bros as well as Running Man. Very, very excited for both. Honestly, I don't know which one I'd be more excited for. Knowing Bros has a different style, very more kind of like just asking questions, kind of like discussion. Running Man is more physical, a lot more just like comedic, like slapstick humor, like physical humor fun. So I think that there's a place for both of them. I'm very, very excited to just see the girls on these variety shows, as I mentioned, because it's been been a very very long time since they actually last appeared on any type of variety show so you can bet that it's gonna be a very very exciting time and just today the day of me recording this actually is the day that blackpink light up the sky was released and honestly to date i've only been influxed by like people mentioning it on both all social medias even on youtube people are inserting clips which i'm not too too a fan of because i feel like we should just watch out the actual full thing in netflix i'm contemplating um just watching it and then giving you guys my thoughts please let me know if you want that to happen please let me know in the comments if you want that to see that happen. apart from that um i'm just very excited and i definitely will be trying to react to at least some clips for knowing bros as well as running Mare for you guys in the meantime if you want to go check out i have the blackpink playlist linked in the description box as i mentioned there's a bunch of their prison interviews their songs the album loves it girls ice cream everything is there for you guys if you want to go check it out there are dance practice on top of it all so hopefully you guys do stay tuned for my future blackpink reactions and until then thank you so much for watching and as always, if you have any comments, questions, or something you want to talk, feel free to leave it in the comment section below, and I'll get to it as soon as possible. With that being said, guys, this has been Tony. Goodbye, and I'll see you in the next video.